I see we're going to get full racist here. Must resist urge. So, wait, that's the fire bridge? Oh, I literally thought it would be a bridge on fire. I have been lied to. And it makes me sad. And rise. That. And I have probably no idea what I'm doing. Oh, okay, that's what's over there. Okay. That explains it. So let's abuse the slope detection on this game, shall we? And right there. Jump. No. Too early. I might be able to. I still made it. Whoop. All right. And give me what is in the box. What is in the box? Is it theme park near to come? Uh, no, there is no wild, uh, wild waves in California, then. At least if, uh, dark, what Dark Power is saying is true. Which I wouldn't be surprised, because, uh, we mostly have not Soak City. The only other theme park that's water that I can think of is Legoland built a water attraction for their theme park, I remember. That's another theme park I've not been into for a long time, and that's Legoland. I went there the year it opened. I feel old. Then again, I am the type of person... Ow! I'm dead. Not dead. Not dead. Perfect. I, then again, I am the person who said that he remembers when Disneyland tickets were $30. So, yeah, I'm starting to get into the age to where I can be old. Soon I will get my senior discounts. And it will be glorious. But I see something over there. Can I go over that way, I wonder? Because I still need to open that door. Alright. Let's try... Let's wait for you to come back, because I don't trust it. Right, raging water. Um, Southern California, Darkheart? No, we do not have a raging water. That one, I know for a fact we used to have. We used to have one, but it's gone. It is kaput. Gone. Gone for good. Never to return. Unfortunately. Oh! The upper level's on the other side of the door. Navigate the Asian boat ride. Yeah, I will navigate that in a second. First things first, get back on the dragon. And go back up and whoop. There we go. Now I wonder. Those platforms are like that. Can I just thin? Oh! Cursed reticle. Okay, I'm just going to play it safe and just go right here. Okay, so you can thin the cloud. Good to know. Did not want to thin the cloud. Don't do that, game. In this? Okay, no. Alright. Uh, can I make it over here? Okay, so that's how you open the door, but I kind of want to see what's over there. Oh, how would I get to over there? Oh, wait, no, that's where I came from, isn't it? Which means that was an area I could have come to beforehand, so you know what? Screw it. Let's get out of here. I'm tired of spending time inside the world of gremlins. There are a couple, uh, going back on to the topic of theme parks, there are a couple other theme parks that are around inside here. There's uh, Balboa Park, which is a local little park that's at the bottom of, that's by uh, the bay. Oh, Captain Pete, I see you are here right now. But uh, Balboa Park used to have a lot more attractions inside it. One of the things I remember the most was when Balboa Park had a little Pirate's Cove area. That, in all honesty, sounds a bit like how Five Nights at Freddy's is in Five Nights at Freddy's 2. And I remember the coolest uh, attraction for inside there was that there were two buildings you can go inside and there was a huge little tunnel underground that you could go into. It was closed down so, six or seven. And I remember I always wish that it would come back. Guessing my age? No, I'm actually only 20. You're off by 10 years. But according to Afro Battler, I'm old. But, you know, I, I don't count being old until I am, you know, at least 25. That's when you can start to count that you're being old. Anyway... 
I remember reading in a review one time, because that's literally like the only thing I ever said, is pretty much want to get things, it's at the top route inside these like screen projector sections. And that's pretty much the case with what it looks like. Although I do love how the shading and everything looks for this, because it, this actually looks pretty cool. I kind of wish they would have done like what uh, Kingdom Hearts 2 did in the um, trying to make it sound a bit like old and rustic by limiting the audio, but I guess they didn't. Okay. And in we go. So, enter the world of gremlins. And another loading screen with an interesting postcard. That would be an interesting postcard to send to someone. I kind of wish that I would have gone through plain, plain crazy. That would be kind of cool. Alright. So where am I now? I have no idea where I'm at. Maybe this cutscene will tell me. Are you sure it's been attacked? I mean, even with all the paint, it looks pretty meh. What house, Gus? Your house is gone! Completely! Alright, so my mission is to save Gus's house. What if I don't want to save Gus's house? Maybe I want to be a dick. Maybe Gus doesn't deserve to have his house. Maybe he just, you know, nobody deserves to have their house. Everyone can be homeless. No, I can't do that. That would be mean. Right, fix that. Fix that! That should restore power. Right, sounds like a plan. First things first, got to patch that up. Gotta patch it up. Actually, no, this looks like the... Yeah, there's something down here. A crusher! Ow! Okay, I did not... I couldn't tell where the crusher was and wasn't. Fiji is the oldest one here. Fiji is now old man. All right. So keep running, Roxas. Or get that back on power, and then keep running, Roxas. Gotcha. Alright, so fix that. Fix that. Over here. Do, 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 do. Get over here. And fix that. And fix that. There we go. Yes, I know. I'm going to do that. But first things first, I want to get that gold thingy that was right over there. And also beat up some lawn gnomes. Take that, lawn gnome. You're creepy. Alright. So, must remember, keep running. Okay, so I was right. There are two crushers. Okay, where does it land? Okay, here's the area to where it was. This is what I was looking for. Right. Nope. See, I don't like that you can't tell where it is. Alright. And up we go. And now nobody needs to go and get crushed in there. There we go. Everyone's happy. Everyone's nice. Look at this man. This man probably loves his house. This man has no house. Interesting. And now he has a house. What about this? Maybe maybe this is his house. You know, in hindsight, when I'm painting and thinning these houses, a sudden realization occurred to me. This is the only thing that these people own, and I'm stealing it. Eh, good thing karma is not really a big thing in this game, like how it is in Fallout. Great. Oh, this must be this is interesting. All right, so let's go and fix his house because you know Gus really needs his house. Gus will get his house later. I got to turn this off first. First, platforming. Can I make that? Yes. That. Take it. Go down. Can I break the pot? Nope. Okay. Alright, let's go and spin on that now, since that's... I've been ignoring this for a bit. And then Roxas said, Let there be power!
Yes, I can fix your house. Or I can go to the rides to go around. All right, that boat right there must be Small Pete's. Those tower as well. Pump up there that can operate it. All right, so open the gates. All right, so that sounds like a plan. But first things first, I need to go and give Gus back his house. Otherwise, he will never stop whining about it. There, I saved Gus's house. Now he won't. Now he can shut up about it. Now you get no house, Gus. You get no house. You are homeless. No, I can't be a dick. Oh, I didn't mean to talk to you. This is Small Pete fault. So, seems Small Pete is... Hmm, might be a villain. That's not good at all. What is down there? Looks like a chest. I remember this. This is like... Oh my, that was... Not the way I was supposed to go. Okay, gotcha. What do I want to do? Right, go right over here. Right. Anything in here? Nope. Okay. Enter the... I can enter the houses? Can I loot them? Is there... Is there can, can I... Just a 2D section. I was promised treasure. Fine. I'll loot them of their paint. Fiji, I did go good in Fallout 3 because being bad in... Because being bad and being good in Fallout games, it makes you feel like a dick when you're bad. And I don't like being like a dick. Unless I'm just in a bored mood and then I just end up just destroying everything. I could be spiteful, I will admit. Although in Fallout 3, the karma system is completely screwed up, so... There is that. For example, the time in which you need to go and save a baby by killing its mother and father right in front of it, and then, you know, dooming everyone else to be eaten alive, that is the good option. The bad option is the slavery, especially when you end up finding certain things out later. All right, so let's enter this gremlin house. More paint. Grab the I guess I can't grab the paint. This person is lucky because I cannot loop them. Here I was hoping to get a collectible bobblehead. Alright, so I should probably go and find a way to fix the tower. Although, I could go through the screen and completely ignore this. Interesting, interesting. Nope, we're gonna go and try and fix the tower. Jump up. Break that. Alright. Uh, is there any way I can get up there? Whoa, that was close. Whew. Right, go this way. This is the house I went inside first, I think. So, don't need to go inside there. Instead, what I need to do is climb up here. Perfect. I am precariously platforming in ways I'm probably not supposed to be doing. But I'm here where I am. So, that's good. Is there anything inside here? Oh, there's a ticket. It seems that these tickets are indeed currency, so it's always good to get these tickets. Oh, I scared him. I'm so sorry. Ooh! That is a nice way to show appreciation. A 50 ticket, that's interesting. Hmm, it pays to talk to NPCs, I guess. Can I, can I film these? Interesting, I can. I should always know when I can paint and when I can thin. Also, that was totally what I meant to do. Right, so how can I get up further? I mind is curious. Can I paint that? Nope. Right. Let's go into first person and see what I can look around here. Because what I need to do is I need to get to platforms like this. Mickey can jump actually really high in this game. I never noticed that. Okay, maybe I jump up right here and then... Yeah, this looks like how I would do it. Okay. 
right? There we go. I am doing this in the completely wrong roundabout way. I am probably certain, but this is still fun. Oh! I probably would have died for that. <laughs> 